everyone, welcome back to another episode of Your Daily Dose. We're back at it with some more Dynasty Pioneer Scrolls. Uh, it has the end of a event. The arms race has finished. We will be doing uh, some spending of those gold merit coins. However, that won't be until the power up today in VC. Be sure to join us. It should be around 5 p.m. Australian Eastern Standard Time. So by the time this video loads up, probably uh, about half an hour after this one gets up there. Um, if you are a new member to the Discord, welcome, of course. Jump into the with the link in the description field below. We'll just be doing uh, a little bit of a review, having a chat, seeing what the game has in store for us. And of course, we will be spending all of these resources. And we do have quite a few resources. Um, we did wail a little bit in the last two events, including this one. So hopefully that will get us into a reasonable fighting position. I want to say, um, I mean, it might be ambitious with all the star karma and crap that we've got in the bag. We could probably reach around 18 trillion, maybe, maybe 20. Um, but it also just comes down to the current events that we have as well. So we actually do have the billionaire event. And as you can see, it is, I mean, you look, you can, you can get the fat dude. <laughs> you can get the peacock and the fat dude. Um, he is the DPS and I'm going to assume that this guy is a support. Um, I would say maybe it does a little bit of damage as well, but I think it's damage reduction from what I can see. Um, uh, abnormal status reduction. So maybe he's a little bit of an all rounder inflicts pain of bindings to the general lasting two rounds chance of additionally for sorrow of confusion. Um, he looks like he's, he's mm, definitely a support. I'm going to go with support for the Phoenix. Um, but obviously we need to build them. And I'm glad that I held off on spending the tokens, the gold merits, um, to build these guys just yet. We may need to spend a little bit of it, but if we do get lucky, we should be able to get one of these mices. And of course, then we have this guy over here, the uh, Dijang, whatever you want to call him, um, the Blob. And he definitely looks like he's more of a, a DPS. More of a DPS. Um, he does do some status buffs as well, which isn't terrible. But ultimately, we all know the truth. Everyone's going to be building these pets. Um, and that's pretty much it. Of course, though, if you do want to get beast equipment, I doubt anyone's maxed both of these ones out yet. But if you are whaling significantly hard, you can always get some of this beast equipment. Um, obviously, it's the best one out there. But just be mindful. Eventually, like this equipment, this equipment will appear... Um, for your your realm beast attack attempts so eventually you'll be able to fight your fabled monsters and get the fabled gear so don't stress too much about it and obviously uh keep saving up for the the i, I don't know why they call him heavenly chaos but um but the wolf guy <laughs> basically start saving up for the wolf guy um we do have a couple of these ones as well now i noticed that there is a uh, in the events, there is, we've got to grab that. There is an exchange. So you can, for, for whatever random reason, if you did have gold, uh, dice, you can exchange them for the mythic dice. If you have mythic dice, you can go ahead and exchange those ones out for the arcane dice. It is a one for one exchange. So we do have uh, 15 of those. So we're going to exchange those out and get 15 more arcane. Now there are limitations on how many you can exchange. I think the maximum is, uh, 33 per event. So if you do have quite a bunch of these and you didn't pull for whatever reason, they've just been sitting in your bag. Um, uh, just be mindful of that, that you can do that each event just so that you can sort of pull for one of the more relevant heroes or the beasts, I should say. They are a little bit old. They are getting along in the tooth, but it, it is what it is, right? Then, of course, um, we are before we do any of the pulls here, we will need to pull some of these ones out of the bag, which we have 45 of you. The drop rates never really change. The Arcane Mouse and the Mythic Mouse is still about 1%, if I remember correctly. Um, 
Arcane 0.16%. And then the Mythic Mouse is... Is the Mythic Mouth the Heaven Mouth? Um, hmm. Gold Spirit Mouse has a 0.16% chance. Yeah, pretty much the same. Um, I thought it was 1%. For some reason, in my mind, I was like, yeah, there's like 1%. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I should know better. Um, and obviously, people are pulling for them. So, people are going to go into the Arcane Ranking. And then, people are going to be trying to pull for the Fabled as well. So, we will be doing uh, quite a few of them. Now, obviously, I mean, I'm, I'm probably never going to use this. But if I can get on the leaderboard, what do I need to do? I don't, I don't feel like we could probably still get on the leaderboard just to get some, um, some free, uh, tokens. I mean, realistically, I could wait for the next time this event rolls around and just pull that way, but I don't know. I don't know. It, it doesn't, it doesn't stress me too much about that. Although obviously I still need to upgrade some of those beasts, but the main thing that we're trying to do today is do some pulls here because we do we do want to win. We do want to get the guaranteed 300 uh, as a reward. <sighs> I know, right? I'm going to be knocking one day off unless they decide to whale for it. But that's, that's what I will be doing this event. And uh, in order to do that, we are going to go ahead and buy some of these packages. So these packages, if you just want the guaranteed shards, you can pretty much go ahead and build this guy and get him start up if that's your choice. You will get some of these ones. These are probably the better value out of all of them. Um, obviously, if you spend the 99 pack, you do get the guaranteed one copy of this guy. Um, and of course, you get some, some spare ones left over. If you are like me and you like to gamble, um, you can get 110 of these. I don't know why anyone would pick Arcane Dice, to be completely honest with you. Um, and then, of course, you could pick Transformation as well, but everyone's really going for the Heavenly Dice. So we are going to go ahead and purchase this pack. So we're going to go ahead and claim that. And, of course, we do get the Guaranteed Fable Weapon as well. And then on top of that, we're going to go ahead and purchase this one too. So that should put us pretty close to being able to... Um, we should be able to do maybe 200 i think yeah because we got 43 of those ones and then uh for you it won't be 200 will it be 160 of you so i won't be spending any of those ones um obviously in the the transformation realm but we'll talk about that in a second um in terms of this though i think if i'm not mistaken yeah we hit vip 13 <laughs> Congratulations. The one thing we probably didn't want to do, we did. So we do actually, um, we do get uh, one of these ones, which is pretty cool. We actually do need to get those ones to build them anyway. So we do get uh, 100 shards of that. And it's not too bad in terms of the, um, you know, extra beast pools and all that sort of stuff. Um, I don't know if we'll ever hit VIP 14. I'm not going to lie, that's pretty far off there, 250k. But it is what it is, right? So we'll go ahead and grab that. Now, in terms of the bag, we probably just want to pull out... Um, we actually have 84 of these too. So we're going to go and pull those ones out. So we should probably get on the top of both leaderboards um, this event. But we want to pull out you. So we're going to go and max you out. And then we'll pull you out as well. And that leaves us with 273. So yes, we will be pulling for all of them because we are bananas like that. And we'll go ahead and pull you out too. The other interesting thing is... Where is it? Where are you? Where did you go? I know because I saw you the other day. So much shit in my bag. Um, I think I pulled, wait, no, it was, uh, it was definitely over here. I pulled, uh, this one. Now, uh, you can exchange for this synthesize two and you get a legendary universal. I believe you can actually trade this in for paper charms as well. I think they're like 400, which is like a guaranteed charm and a half. But you know us, we like to gamble. <laughs> so we're going to get the 120 out of there. Um, and that should put us up to 260, uh, no, 280, 
And then um, on top of that, we will do 132 of you and 273 of you. And hopefully we manage to pull uh, something. And we will be doing, uh, in a second, we'll be looking at the Fabled Heroes. So for those that don't want to stick around for the pools themselves, um, you can, of course, build your Fabled. So you can grab one of these guys. I'm not, <laughs> excuse me, just recovering from the flu. I'm not entirely sold on which one to get yet. I am leaning towards this guy, um, but I wouldn't mind going with uh, Shu, which is Yang Fei. I think um, overall he's more of a DPS orientated with that heaven ability. Now, I don't think that he'll do spectacular things. I'm not going to lie. It's not like, oh you know, the main um, character is going to do amazing damage, etc, etc. But he may, he may do something instead of just dying. Because um, you kind of want to, you kind of want to go with Arcane, right? So, sorry, not Arcane, <coughs> Fable. I apologize uh, for those with earphones in. Uh, you probably didn't want to go with the Fabled Hero. So it's probably going to be this guy here. I may, um, I may wait to the power up video before we actually, uh, well, not, no, no, not the video, sorry, the live stream before we actually decide. You can pick time heroes as well if that's something that you're interested in, um, just for the indexes, shits and giggles. Uh, potentially, I could go with Martong and just keep it all warlord, but really, your main protectiveness doesn't do that much, so you're better off picking something that it may actually contribute to the team, stay alive a little bit longer. I'm leaning towards Zhang Fei, but in terms of Wei, obviously they have control and they do tanky stuff. So you may decide to go with that. We may, we'll, we'll decide. We'll check that out in the live stream. Make sure you join us. Um, of course, if we were really, really crazy, we could just spend all of our paper shards and get the Flame Emperor. Um... And that would have been like amazing, like no, no lie, like back in the day, that would have been amazing. Um, however, because you can get this guy, I just feel like there's no point. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I just feel like there's no point in spending those paper charm shards at all. If you can obtain one of these characters for free, um, uh, it just, yeah, it doesn't make any sense for me being an arcane outfit to spend any more. Um, obviously it's up to you though, if you, uh, you know, if you're hell bent on getting all of the outfits for the indexes, go right ahead. Maybe you've wailed out, maybe you've maxed everything out and you want to do that. Um, outside of that, there's not really anything else that I would particularly want to purchase. Uh, yeah, maybe indexes. That's really, that's really where it like, sort of lies, uh, where you're, you're at with your, combinations and stuff like that you can buy some more outfits for those it's up to you completely uh, but yeah i think that's that's pretty much where we're going for it um it just doesn't make any sense to go below the um the fabled any longer like i really wouldn't be wanting to or recommending you know buying any of the the uh the arcane type of heroes or transformations it just doesn't make any sense um, mainly just because they get crapped on uh, with the Fabled Heroes. They basically do no damage to them. So, with that said, let's go ahead and do some pulls and see if we get lucky. Let me know in the comment section down below what you think we're going to get. And um, I might slow it down a little bit if I can find that helper lady. Help. And can we like... Negative, negative. We don't want to, we don't want to blow it too far. You know what I'm saying? Like we kind of want it to be a little bit slower. So anyway, my prediction is that we will at least get one mouse. Um, I don't know what mouse we'll get, but we will get a mouse. Um, hopefully it is the, uh, not the arcane mouse, <laughs> but that's okay. If we do get that, that's okay as well. Maybe we can do some solo pulls. The old luck of the solo. Get him, get him like close to the other mouse. Alright, let's do a 10 bomb. Oh, I actually thought that might have done it. I really did. Can we at least get a gold jackpot? 
No, I don't want to say that. That's that's a terrible thing to say, PB. 35 to go. No jackpots. Um, haven't really seen too many of the Arcane Token jackpots either. Oh, there we got a couple of threes. Then we have five left. Can we at least land on something of value? We could not. Ah, that's that's intense. But there you go. We did the one three twenty, uh, and we got a couple of these encounters. We'll save those ones for later. It's just gold essentially. Um, but if we go to the shop, what does that mean for the tokens? How many of these things do we actually have? Oh, we can actually exchange these too. Ah, okay. So we should be able to at least get one. No, when we're short, how short are we? 98. But that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter because we can always just, you know, pull out some shards there. So that's 58 for the tiger dude. Um, what else can we get? Well, we shouldn't, we can definitely, uh, we can definitely finish this guy. Well, not finish him, but we can definitely get some of those. We've got the peacock as well. Well, 98, a bit underwhelming, really, when you think about it. Um, obviously, we don't need those ones. We would uh, not need the legendary ones. But if we go into this one, oh yeah, I, I guess we could have exchanged the, the arcanes for this. We, we can still do it, right? We get 16 of them, though. That seems, like, pretty dodgy. Nah. Maybe, maybe we can... Now Now the, 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 the luck is going to run off, and we have 273 pulls... Uh, is this a waste to do 273? Absolutely it is, but we're going to do it anyway. I would not recommend doing this. I would just recommend doing it until you came first. Um, but where's the fun in that? Oh, you actually get the arcane tokens. Look at me stressing for nothing. All right, little mousy, come to Papa. We need one or two of you little mousies. I said we need one or two of you little mousies. Come on. Eh, at least we're getting twos. Twos and threes are better than ones. Maybe we can try some solo pulls. Sometimes my solo pull luck is crazy. Come on. I know you do get the guaranteed three after 10, or is it the guarantee? Yeah, I think it's guaranteed two after 10 pulls. So let's see. 140 to go. I'm not sure if we're even going to get that other jackpot. That's crazy. Come on, game. Maybe they really did lower the drop rates. 10 more. Do the solo. You wait. It'll just, the game will give me all the, the paper charms instead. And three, two, one. Nada. That was crazy sauce. But. We were only really doing it for the arcane stuff and this. So we've got like, oh, hey, there we go. At least we can pull out one of these. Maybe, mm, should we, should we spend, how many is this? 39. Math is hard. Yes. If we spend the arcane, we can get the peacock and the, uh, blob and of course the reward is 300 of those and then of course we get the 300 for these ones as well um so i mean yeah maybe that's not a bad idea maybe we do go the peacock and the blob after that all right let <laughs> we're gonna find out eventually um but let's just go into this one now. So to finish off the video, we're going to be doing some of these summons. 280. We realistically need... Uh, how many do we need? So we can get two of these paper shards. So... Oh, actually. Wrong one. Let's go buy them anyway. So we need... 
I think we only need like, oh geez, like 300 and something and we should be good. 300? Yeah, I think we only need 300. So I'm pretty sure even with that terrible RNG that we just witnessed, we should be able to get at least 300. Um, cause I know that you do get the guarantee 12. So at least we can, at least we can get that. That's all I'm going to say is that, that we should be able to get to that 300 mark. <laughs> I'd be surprised if we couldn't, although it would be nice to actually pull like an actual paper charm shard before we get there, like a full one. And then we can start saving up for the next generation of heroes. Alrighty then. Because there is no leaderboard on this, um, there really is no reason for me to save. Plus, we do actually want to see a jackpot for crying out loud, even if it's just a gold one. 110. And we hit the 400 mark, so we should be good. Couple more to go. Oh yeah, there we go. Finally hit the paper charm shard. So that saved us some of the next one around. Maybe we can back to back it. 10 more. Boom. All right then. 280. We got one shot and 400 and like nine, 409 of these actual shards themselves, the paper. So that means we're going to go in there and purchase one more. And how many could we actually buy? All right. Anyway, buy that one there. We need to buy one more. We always pick the wrong one. Always. Um, Hey, we've got like a couple left over. We've got a couple left over. We could do an index. <laughs> we could do an index. I'm not saying we should do an index, but we could do an index. But at least we have the six of those guaranteed. Uh, thank you so much for watching thus far. Like I said, we will be doing the power up in the VC. I'm going to be fixing all of these heroes around. Uh, pulling out some fabled gear, doing all the other stuff. We have some scarlet gear, just maxing everything out that we could possibly max out. And then, yeah, going from there. But let, it, let us know in the comments down, section down below if you can't join the VC stream. Uh, what do you predict our power up will be after everything is said and done? Take into consideration, we do have a lot in our bag. We have a lot of stuff in our bag. We're definitely going to be working on indexes and combo charms and all the other stuff. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking 18. I'm thinking 18 trillion. I reckon we get an extra five. Being ambitious, but maybe we should go a little higher. Uh, but if you've stuck around thus far, thank you so much. It does, uh, it really does help if you do hit that like, subscribe, notification button. We will be coming back with all the other games as well. The Warlord game, a One Piece game, um... Might even do some idle heroes, just randomly throw that in there for the Christmas event. So stay tuned over the next 11 plus days. We'll be doing a daily dose each and every day. And thank you so much. And yes, like I said, join us in the Discord down below and we'll have a chat there very, very shortly. Until next time.